We begin tonight with breaking news. Three women have been rescued in a sex trafficking sting. 7 Action News reporter Aaron Baskerville in southwest Detroit with new information on this investigation. Aaron? Stephen and Carolyn, still a very active scene out here. I'm on Electric Street in southwest Detroit. I can tell you that the Michigan State Police, they also just showed up. But like you said, earlier this afternoon, three women were rescued from a house just a few houses down from me. Two 31 years old, uh, two women that are 31 years old, also a woman who was 40 years old. They were taken to the hospital to be checked out. Take a look at the VO right here. We also can tell you this is some video just from about an hour ago. We are not showing any faces because some of the officers are undercover. A 69 year old man has also been arrested. But you mentioned some new information. That new information is we are learning that this could possibly be linked to an organized prostitution ring out of Port Huron. That's what we're learning. We reached out to the FBI. They will not comment on an open investigation. They are not confirming that, only telling us they were asked to come here by Detroit. Police. I had the chance to talk to a neighbor just a little while ago. Here's what she told me. She doesn't want to be identified when she found out what was going on. That hurt because I have children. I have daughters. I have a daughter and a granddaughter. It hurt it. I started hyperventilating. I thought somebody had died or something. I really didn't know what was going on. So once again, a very fluid situation. Three women had to be rescued. They were taken to the hospital. A 69-year-old man has been arrested, and it's possible that this could be linked to an organized prostitution ring out of Port Huron. Right now, you have FBI, state police, also some Detroit police officers on scene. We'll be out here for a while. Let's send it back to you guys in the All studio. Right. Aaron Baskerville reporting live tonight. We know there's a follow-up coming. Thank you, Aaron. Yeah, thank you.